If a Muslim is elected president of America does he have to swear on the Quran? You don't technically have to swear on the Bible. You can swear on any book. Same thing in court. So in that context a Muslim can swear on the Quran if they want. But it isn't necessary. Edit. As pointed out, you can pretty much swear on anything. Or just raise your right hand. Atheists can just affirm. It seems Om one sort on a replica of Captain America's shield. I am okay with that. Lol. I swear on me mum. No. You don't have to swear on any particular text. Or any at all. I think a congresswoman a few years ago actually swore on a law textbook. A local politician was sworn in in the Triforce shield from Legend of Zelda. I've always wondered why we don't have presidents swear on the Constitution. There is no requirement that a president or other elected leader must swear on the Bible or even a book at all while reciting the oath of office. Using a religious text is just an unofficial, albeit very popular, tradition, for what it's worth. While most presidents have sworn on their religion's holy book, there have been a few exceptions, such as John Quincy Adams taking the oath on a law book. Lyndon Johnson was sworn in with little notice. So he ended up swearing in on a Catholic missal even though he wasn't Catholic. If a future president swore on anything other than a Bible, it's clear that doing so would be perfectly fine from a legal perspective. Article 6. Clause 3 of the U.S. Constitution says. The senators and representatives before mentioned, and the members of the several state legislatures, and all executive and judicial officers, both of the United States and of the several states, shall be bound by oath or affirmation, to support this Constitution, but no religious test shall ever be required as a qualification to any office or public trust under the United States. Muslims are not supposed to swear on the Quran. So that's a good question. I still don't understand why they don't have to swear on the Constitution. They can swear on anything. John Quincy Adams swore on a legal textbook. Roosevelt didn't swear on anything. Lyndon B. Johnson swore on some sort of a book about conducting mass. So we can assume the book you swear on is entirely decoration. They don't have to swear on a Bible. They can swear on whatever they want already. Technically you can be sworn in on a stack of Hustler magazines if one wants. There is no legal requirement. You don't have to swear on the Bible. I'd recommend swearing on the Magna Carta. You can swear on whatever the fuck you want to swear on. I'm reminded of this. GIF. They could choose to. They wouldn't have to. I'm pretty stoned and think maybe somewhere I saw someone say, they can swear in on whatever they want, I'm swearing in on a kitten. There are much bigger obstacles to a Muslim president than this. I don't think he or she would be able to swear on the Koran as Republicans flying Trump and Confederate flags chanting, stop the steal, would storm the podium, zip tie them and hang them prior to the actual swearing in. He doesn't have to. He technically could. Why not? If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Aircast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.